Hey guys, Airgun Angie with Gateway to Airguns. I've got the Seneca Dragon Claw here. Oh, this is a 50 caliber air rifle. And yes, it's very pretty, very nice to look at, but it also packs a pretty hard punch. Really quick, I want to say thank you to Gateway to Airguns for making this video possible. Go check them out, guys, www.gatewaytoairguns.org, www.gatewaytoairguns.org. I've already sighted it in. I've taken it out to the range. I've done some shooting with it, gotten used to it, gotten comfortable with it. Now it's time to take this one to the stand and see if we can get a hog. So again, guys, just like it was in the last few hunts, I really didn't expect anything to come in early. They had been coming in late at night and early in the morning, and I had planned to sit as long as I needed to this time. So I sat, and next thing I know, here comes the trio. I believe they're all little boar hogs. They're not very old. They're quite young. They might be about 80-pound hogs. Um, they came in, and I was prepared to get ready to take one of them when they made a squeal and they took off. They, they didn't stay for very long. So I was convinced that I did something or maybe moved in a way that they saw me and I thought, oh man, I just ruined it. So um, I sat there for a little while longer, hoping and praying that they would come back and I sat and held the gun up for a good 10 minutes, trying not to move at all. And then comes in this guy, totally unexpected. And I realized they didn't leave because they heard or saw me. They, le they left because they saw or heard this guy coming in. So this guy came in, he got just, I don't really wait too long before I take a shot because like I said, hunting is unpredictable. You never know how long they're going to stay. You never know if they're going to take a bite. You never know what they're going to do. So as soon as I get the shot, I take it. And I found the shot. The opportunity was right there. I took it and dropped it. So after I finished thanking the Lord for being so awesome, I celebrate a little bit more with um, letting you guys know what just happened. Oh, that's what scared the other ones off was that one right there. Three younger ones came in and I thought I did something. I thought they knew I was here and they did not. It was him. He came in. I got the guy with the white on his back. So it's time to go get this one.
126. We loaded this one up and he wound up being about 128 pounds. I, we skinned him ourselves and then took him to the processor the next morning because the processor wasn't there that night. I'd like to say thank you to Pyramid Air for sending me this air gun to check it out, to test it, to get to go take it on a hunt because that's what this video is all about. Thank you so much Pyramid Air. If you guys are looking for a new air gun, maybe some accessories, maybe an optic, and plenty of other things, targets and such, go check them out, www.pyramidair.com. Thanks again, Pyramid Air. And ATN, you guys make some great optics and great accessories. Thank you all so much. I also want to thank Raging Board Outdoors for supplying the bait to bring these hogs in to be able to harvest them. I'm Airgun Angie with Gateway to Air Guns. Y'all don't just have a good day. Have an awesome one. See ya. Pretty eyelashes.